So if you're working through your LIDAR and there are three bat files, um, one of them uh, creates a height map, I believe, and the other two are like uh, TIFF to JPEG bat files. Um, they're the ones at the very beginning of the tutorial where you have to go in and you have to change to make sure your path is correct. Um, there's a couple of things that can go wrong in those. One, first of all, one thing is they don't like spaces and folder names. Um, if your path is wrong, pointing to the executable for uh, QGIS, you might have some problems. But the problem is it doesn't give you much feedback on when things do go wrong. So let me show you. So here is a TIFF, the TIFF to JPEG. So I got my TIFFs in here. And so here's the TIFF to JPEG. And, and, and what I'm about to show you will work in any of the batch files that we do. Okay. So let's say I run this and it's running fine. And you can see it's running fine because it gives you feedback in here. Um, great. So I'm just going to stop this and uh, let me just clean this up quick um, but if there's a problem for example let me show you let me open up notepad and it's got it in here right now so here's my tiff let me just say that this is in the wrong directory that could be one thing it's wrong but there could be multiple things in here that that are wrong okay so let me just make this wrong and then uh, let me just do a file save and then when I go run this well, nothing happens, right? Well, actually what happens is in the background, you can't see it. A, a command prompt window is opened up, but it errors out and then immediately closes. Well, we wanna see what that error is. So this is how we do that. Um, come down here to the search and open up a command prompt. And it's gonna open you up until your, your user directory. Um, what you need to do is change to where this stuff is being held. So if I click this down arrow in my Explorer, changes this, highlights that, and I am going to control C to copy that path that's in there. So I'm hitting control C right now. So now it's on my clipboard. And I'm gonna come back over here to my command prompt. Now I know, actually let me post this in here for you so you can see, that's what it looks like. So that is the uh, the full path of where this bat file sits. It's, in, it's on my D drive, okay? So we need to get in there. Now, this is on my D drive. For you guys, it might be on your C drive. Um, if it's on your C drive, you can just do, well, um, let me show you. First of all, for me, since it's on my D drive, the first thing I need to do is switch to my D drive by hitting D colon, and now I'm on my D drive. If you're not, and you're just on your C drive, then the step that you can do is this, which is CD, which stands for change directory, space, and now I'm gonna right click and it's gonna put in there what's in my uh, clipboard, okay? Now I'm gonna hit enter. And now you can see that I am in that directory on the command prompt where this TIFF to JPEG is. And I can look at this by typing DRR, which stands for directory, and it'll list everything in here, including you can see, I can verify that my TIFF to JPEG bat file is in there. Now I can run it and it's not gonna close this window. So if I just type in TIFF and I hit tab, It'll just fill it out automatically. I hit enter and it's gonna run. And now you can see that I see the errors, okay? So I'm seeing in here for blah, 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 QGIS. Um, let's see, it's, so it's erring out at, the system cannot find the path specified. So what's that path? Well, here, okay? So if you just, if you don't, if this doesn't tell you what's wrong, you could at least post this to the Discord and someone else in there like myself or perhaps AT can take a look at this. But this is pretty clear that we've got the path wrong. So it'll give you at least some feedback and a direction on what you did. So just take a screenshot of this and post it in the Discord if you can't figure it out yourself, okay? Um, that's it.